Good morning, Devil's Lake High School. Here are your morning announcements for Wednesday, November 3rd. I'm Kaden. And I'm Ryan. Students, just a reminder regarding visitor parking. Students are not allowed to park in visitor parking or the faculty parking lot any time during the day until or after 3.30. If you are leaving early for games, you are not allowed to park in visitor parking. Detention will be assigned if you park in either lot. Students, hats and hoods are not to be worn in the building. Please pay negative lunch cards. They need to be paid in full. Students, please remind your parents to call in for you when you are not going to be in school. Accurate attendance is very important. Thank you. Congratulations to Emily Green and Madden Parker, who competed in the state Olympic weightlifting this weekend in Fargo. Emily took first, breaking two state records, lifting 235 pounds, and has qualified for nationals in Las Vegas. Madden also qualified for nationals, lifting 170 pounds. Coach Steve Engbret is very proud of his team, and they all did very well in Fargo. Congratulations again to Emily and Madden. Wrestlers, be sure to get all forms and fees into the activities office. Check Google Classroom for the schedule. Mr. Phil will be hosting our first FCA Fellowship of a Christian Athletes Huddle this Wednesday at 6.30 p.m. in Mr. Marquardt's room, SC2. Saturday is volleyball play-in game, volleyball C-Squad tournament at Shanley. Your lunch for today is fajita wrap, fresh veggies, fruit, and milk. Weather is a high of 46, low of 25, with a 5% chance of precipitation. Your quote for today is keep mov moving forward. Kid Cuddy. These have been your morning announcements. Have a great day. Hi, my name is Madden Parker, and today we have a Superman Red Bull Blaster with Cream and a Raspberry Vanilla Italian Soda. And we're going around the school and having students and teachers rate them. This is Ashlyn Abrahamson. This one's a Superman Red Bull Blaster. Drink it all. Cream, if you want to. Mm -hmm. This one's good. I'd rate it like mm -hmm. 9 out of 10. Alright. Then this one's a uh, raspberry vanilla Italian soda. This one's not the best. I'd say like 5. Alright, thank you. Yep. This is Mr. Potter, and he's going to try the Superman Red Bull Blaster first. Ooh! That's a 7 out of 10. Okay. We like it. And that's the raspberry vanilla Italian soda. That's, that's, a, that's a 3. That's not good. Alright, thank you. Yeah. This is Isabel Thompson. So, <laughs> this one's a raspberry vanilla Italian soda. Mm -hmm. That's a five. That's a five. <laughs> I don't like that. Then that's um, a Superman Red Bull Blaster with cream. That's an eight. I don't want cream. Hi. Clear the palette. <laughs> this is Mr. Cooker. So this one's the raspberry vanilla Italian soda. I had a roommate in college who was an artist, and he was an art major. Okay. What do you rate it? Um, eight. Then this is a Superman Red Bull Blaster with ice. Mmm, tasty. This is seven and a half. Okay, thank you. Okay. Alright, this is Marquardt, and this one's raspberry vanilla Italian soda. Hmm. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go with a seven. Here's why. Doesn't have a full flavor. It's got a weird aftertaste to it. Sparkling stuff really doesn't do it for me. And it's just like there's something missing. Fair enough. Alright, this one's a Superman Little Blaster. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like this is a joke one that you guys didn't make for people to drink. It's a good one. I ordered that.
tastes way better than it smells. <laughs> it's pretty heavy on the Red Bull, which I think saves it. Because that smells like feet. <laughs> I'm gonna give that first one a seven. I'm gonna give the second one a nine. Cause this one tastes like you would get it out of a can. This one feels like you made a mistake. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna say. Uh, Check you. this out. Mixing them's not a bad idea. <laughs> Cause the first one was missing something. I think you found it. That color's gross, though. All right, thank you. Yeah.